All right, y'all. We're back in another video. We're back in another video. Before we get into this video, if you guys want to watch the original reaction to this game 4, go ahead and click the link in the comments. That's pretty much where games 1 through 4 have been. I'm not watching the Celtics. The Celtics, their playoff run was easy. Like, y'all don't want to watch Boston play against the Heat with no Jimmy. Y'all don't want to watch the Boston Celtics play against the Cavs or the Orlando Magic, which is basically the same team, the Cavs and the Magic, just to get smoked in five games to the Celtics. And then they play in the Pacers. Y'all don't want to see that. If you already see the video now, four views in that one video, y'all ain't trying to see that. I don't even want to see that. But before we get into this and these other side clips, I came across this video from D. Green. P.J. Washington gets caught playing 2K minutes before playoff game. Now it makes sense why P.J. is playing 42 minutes and scoring 10 points in an elimination game with the Minnesota Timberwolves who are literally clawing, fighting for life. P.J. is playing 2K. Played an entire school day plus detention to put up 10 points. 2 of 9 from 3 is crazy. 3 of 13 from the field is ridiculous. He wet the bed in the onesie. He had on a onesie and he wet the bed. Maybe game 5 he'll bounce back, but this, this is nuts. 3 of 13, 2 of 9, 10 points in 42 minutes. Come on now. You want your onesie. You got a pee stain in your onesie. Anyways, let's get into this real quick, bro. Let's see what uh, it was going on with this. Him playing 2 Wow, a playoff game. Bro, ain't PJ Washington in the playoffs, bro? Mid-90s. Minutes before a playoff game, PJ Washington is in the f wreck? This no man way. is playing wreck and he has a playoff game. That's not green. A level 40 99 overall? Uh, off the so he bought his way to level 40. Because I know he ain't sweat his way to this level 40 99 overall. Heavy point? PJ Washington ain't. Offensive heavy point. Now. How you an offensive heavy point because you don't play point guard and offensive heavy, you had 10 points. You literally had 10 points in 42 minutes. How are you offensive heavy and you don't play point guard? When have you been put on an isolation situation? Other than you taking Rudy Gobert, Goofy Gobert to the rack. But you don't get no ISO plays. Offensive heavy point. No point guard? Yeah, you got that from YouTubers, bro. Come on now. The Timberwolves are going out even more sad now, bro. Y'all got PJ Washington not even What build is this? Sad now, bro. Y'all Get got this Planet of the Apes build out the game, man. What is this build? PJ this man made a uh, buck. If y'all watch Planet of the Apes 1, you know who Buck is, bro. He made the gorilla from Planet of the Apes one, bro. Washington not what is even that? taking y'all serious, bro. This nigga is on 2K getting in rec runs. And he's probably playing with randoms. And then on top of that, PJ said I was cooking too. Bro, it felt I like just cooking. yesterday. You need to be cooking on the court. What are you talking about cooking in the game for? Yesterday, you P need to cook on the court. PJ Washington what are you was on doing? the Charlotte Hornets winning like three games a year. And now literally. he's literally about to be in the NBA Finals. This nigga is standing on business on and off the court. Bro, this just goes to show you NBA players. If you're on a team full of nobodies and your team is absolutely dog shit, you have to continue to be a professional, bro. Because you never know when a better opportunity will present itself. When PJ Washington was in Charlotte, he was getting trapped by Instagram thoughts. Stop. Shut the fuck up. The difference is... Miles Bridges was beating up bitches. Yeah. The mellow ball was running over kids. I was just finna say that. You run it over little kids. 
Andrew That's crazy. was getting tatted like his my player. This is nasty. I want to talk about this a few days ago, but I just never had time to talk about it. Bro, what is this? How much? See, this what happens when you have too much free time. How do you have the time to have an alien tramp stamp? This man has an alien with a one on his forehead and one on one on his lower back. This man has an alien tramp stamp. You have got to be kidding. This is how you know you have too much free time. I know his dad sitting in the corner crying, rocking back and forth like Squidward when he was in the future. Like, come on, man. Like, too much free time. What is LaMelo Ball doing? The, too much VC. The Mavericks are on a generational run. They're about to be in the finals, and they're not even taking niggas seriously. Y'all got P.J. Washington running point guard, bro. And credit to P.J. Washington, because every time they have to double Kyrie and Luka, they have to leave P.J. wide open. And he's making them bitches like every time, bro. Again, two for nine. Playing too much to get off the game. You have an NBA finals to be playing in. What are you doing? Hopefully they finish the series off. Oh, I well, who see knows? I'm tired of game six, seven. Like, PJ come on, bro. In the series, Washington bro. missed a three yet. But nah, bro, there's nothing wrong with playing the game in your spare time, but 2K is complete dog shit. Now that I think about it, knowing how much of a dick rider Ronnie is, PJ Washington was probably automatically a 99 overall, bro. Y'all see he already got his face scan in the game. He probably didn't even have to pay to be level 40, bro. But they must be Yeah, paying. I think NBA players is already scanned in the game. They probably just give them their faces with the code PJ or PJ Washington to play this game, bro. Nobody plays 2K anymore, bro. That's, now I know why how did, how did they get that in sync like that? Oh, of course, Jumpman Jeremy. PJ Washington is playing this game because they literally added his pose celebration this been in 2k but i like how they added that in there though but this been in 2k for the longest the slow in pose the game fuck you ronnie you fucking debs sprinted to your computers to add this playoff celebration in the game how about focus on making a better game and fuck you, Mike Wang. None of you devs are safe, bro. Why the hell is there season passes in the game? You guys don't want to update. I never liked seasons to begin with. I didn't understand it. You give us three to five animations per season. Like, what am I supposed to do with that? You know what I mean? Hey, Just Anthony me personally. Edwards is face scan, this is atrocious work. This <laughs> is, bro, who is that, bro? He looked like a bear. He looked like a crossbreed of a chimpanzee and a bear. Who is that? That's not Anthony Edwards. Who is this? Who is this? Right? This like one of those faces people use in 2K for their My Career series. Who is that? But you guys want to add PJ Washington's celebration in the bro, game. Bro, I swear, if they copy Fuck. and paste the same cyber face in the 2K25, you will have to riot. You. Literally, like, stop doing Anthony Edwards like this. Nobody plays this game except PJ Washington, and it's obvious he's under some type of 2K contract. That's the only reason he's playing. The only people that play this game are niggas that get paid to play this game. Nobody plays this game for fun, I promise you. Bro, I cannot wait till NBA Live returns. NBA Live ain't coming back. They said they were supposed to come back two years ago and never did. Anyway, this is Anthony Edwards Rose, 55 year old Mike Conley. After game four, he's old as hell. He is old. Mike Conley's been in the NBA as long as silly bands and wristbands wearing that school been in style.
when Mike Conley was considered an all-star when collecting marbles was a thing. Mike Conley was considered an all-star player on the Grizzlies when collecting marbles was considered a thing. Collecting cards, Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Yeah, I mean, the numbers been in the NBA for how long? Speak for themselves. You know, we showed up defensively tonight against a really great team and uh, did the things we needed to do to win a game, especially on the road. Over here, y'all. Y'all got any questions for Mike? Y'all want to ask me about Mike? Anybody want to ask me about Mike? Bye, bye. How about Mike, especially the first half? It seemed like he really is old as fuck. And he was going to take that Mike Conley? Me personally, he getting put in the headlock from right there. And like these, he's getting hit with an Angel Reese move. I'm telling you. And 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 he was getting downhill, lay, laying the ball up. So shout out to Bike Bike, and he coming in here with these clown. Bike Bike is crazy. And so, on. so y'all about to see him in a minute. But that's my OG. That's my point guard. He played great tonight, and I couldn't ask nothing more from him. So thank you, Mike Conley. Hey, Aunt, uh, Carl, what does what does just getting one mean to you? Just to get on the board here and and, and extend the series. We get another chance to get another one. Pretty simple. Yeah, that's how you know Mike Conley old. I don't care if he is six five. You're catching this Angel Reese. I'm telling you, you're catching you're catching this Alyssa Thomas from right here, and then him with these. I'm telling you, not me. That's just me personally. I don't care if you're 6'5", 220, you're getting this choke slam. Uh, Simple. Um, I think we was talking about the uh the N1. The, yeah, I think that's what we was talking about. It, it was just, you know, it was crazy. And hey, you told somebody in the hallway you were seeing for game six. You told somebody in the hallway you were seeing for game six. What, where does that confidence come from? Um, what am I supposed to say? I'm supposed to say, um, we're going to lose game five. No, I'm not going to never say that. Um, that's Michael good, Parsons. Anthony Edwards, because if you lose game five, I'm getting a ring. I'm telling you that you know, now. He was rocking the eight ones, and I told him he wore a size 14. I bring back some nice shoes for game six. That's what I told him. If you lose game five, I'm getting a ring. Just because you said that. You better not lose game five, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what can we take away from game game four? Before we end this video, what could we what could we learn from game four? They better get rid of us. They better get rid of us, Luke! They better get rid of us, Lou! Man, we can't go home tonight. Man. Yeah, Marcus, bro, Marcus Morris is literally the old head from, from Lottery Ticket, bro. Ice Cube. Man, we can't Just go home Washington. tonight. Man. Bro, Marcus, whatever Morris twin this is, bro, he's literally Ice Cube from Lottery Ticket. Show Mr. Washington. Hey, hey. I got that from you, dog. Come here. We got a rebound, man. We got a rebound. Come on, man. If they win this game, they're going to they gonna, they not going to feel sorry. They're going to laugh at us, bro. We got to put everything on the line. Yeah. I'm just glad he understands that because I would have gotten the raid. If you would have got swept tonight, I'm getting the raid. And, and Goofy Gober would have heard his soundtrack. You said. They not gonna feel sorry for they gonna laugh. If they win this game, it's 4 0 they gonna they not gonna feel sorry for they gonna laugh at us, bro. We got hey, everybody's gonna laugh at you, especially you, because you considered everybody's new age Jordan. So you get smoked, you know what time it is. Put everything on the line. You setting it like this, Rudy. So they can go under, they can go over. Set it like this. So he got to go over the screen. Yes. How was Anthony Edwards at 22 telling Rudy Gobert how to set a screen? That's how you know it's down bad in Minnesota. You've been in the league since 2014. And Anthony Edwards just got to the league three, four years ago, and he's telling you how to set a screen? Birds. Oh, 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 oh. I like it. I like it. 
Every minute, every minute. All right, let's just keep getting stops. Let's keep getting stops. Anyway, what, what would this guy we flip right here? Turn shipping to your advantage. What did we learn from uh, game four? The lively dude didn't play, so that probably messed up their flow on offense. Carl Anthony Towns stopped playing like a roach. It actually scored. He fouled out, but at that point, the game was over with. And then Anthony Edwards was actually aggressive at making shots. And I've been saying this. You're not winning scoring 19, 21, 24. You're not winning. 28 bare minimum. Because if, again, you would have got smoked, and if you get smoked in game five, I'm getting the raid. I'm pointing at the ant on the raid can, and I'm spraying my camera lens, all because you want to get smoked by some horses. But what is it? Kyrie says game four is a Tim Wolf Super Bowl and just an, another game for the Mavs. This is their Super Bowl. Nah, we good. Y'all keep that same music. This is their Super Bowl. This is their Super Bowl. It's just a normal game for us. Get up, man. What in the world? When did he start doing all this? Like, I understand Kyrie can dunk, but when did he start rim hanging and, and slapping glass? When when did he start doing that? When did he equip that? In his in his, in his dunk package. Wizard of Reed once again. And does Kyrie Irving keep his perfect elimination record alive? No, He's 14 and 0 in elimination games. And now, obviously, the Mavs have the chance to sweep the Timberwolves tonight. Do they get it done? Let me know in the Ew. comments section down below. But there's a good moment today at the Mavs shoot around between Kyrie and Shane God. Kyrie hit one of the toughest layups I've ever seen. I don't know how he got this to fall, but he was letting Shane God know about it after. He made a layup like that in the game, too. Like, he, he had in his left hand, the ball just magically went through the basket. This dude's a cheater. He, he's cheating. He's cheating graphics. He's cheating the law of, of physics. The law of gravity. It's Wizard of Reed. Wizard of Reed. Can we can we replace Kyrie with Kawhi Leonard? Can we just do that, please? Because Kawhi is not playing, bro. Kawhi is not playing in no Team USA, bro. I didn't mean to make him go viral like that. Somebody got to get replaced. Take Halle Burton off. Somebody got to go. We need Kyrie on Team USA. We need it. Yeah. Anyways, that's the end of this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. If you're new to the channel, if you subscribe, we really appreciate it. Let me know what you guys think about Game 5. Will Dallas just all of a sudden wake up and choose violence in Minnesota and get the W and end the series off in their house? Or will Carl Anthony Towns light it up, not play like a roach, stop fouling, and, and, and Anthony Edwards keeps being aggressive, keep dropping 30 like I keep telling him to, and, and McDonald's actually scores because McDonald's, this, this right here, I with elimination. this will get you eliminated. Hold on. Welcome everyone to the Western Conference Finals and good this evening. This right here. They say if it's too oh good to be true, God. it must be. I'm about to end the video, bro. I can't do with this. The same accreditations. I'm about to end video. This right here will get you eliminated. This 10 points in 39 minutes will get you eliminated. But they won. 
and, and Gobert thirteen and ten. I mean, it is what it is. But anyways, you guys, let me know what you think in the comment section about this series. I'm gonna see you guys in the next video, man.